Welcome everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to install your uh, your next cloud for your uh, Ubuntu machine, so let's begin here I'm going to the uh, my machine here which is Ubuntu literally, so I will update it first here and then So we're going to we're going to install a lot of things. So so here we're going to install Maria database server and Apache. So let's go here. Yes. going also to put the uh, links in the description so you have only to copy paste because it also uh, I get all the required links so you just like copy pasting and configuring the stuff and that's it so you can skip the this part and the other parts as well if you need here yes also here this one and I'm gonna copy this one Center and here you can find this one from the 
from the official web page website so, so it is all the uh, latest uh, version so here from the web page here you can this is a web page and just here copy link address and that's it and you can download it with the you can download it like this from here and also the md5 This is the MD5, it's the one is here. You can just right click and copy link address and that's it. But I give you the direct uh, link and that's it. Do not make sure you hassle or something. Or to confuse anyone, I don't want to confuse and this one as well ah sorry mm -hmm. yes. check it can check here it's ok extract it gonna take some time okay here you can copy this one minus R to var AV and here nano so you're going to create a new file because you don't have it already here. I'm gonna show it to you. I'm going to show here. Stuff because it's much more better to see the stuff here. So you don't have you have this this default still and default Apache. So you're going to make a no 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 next cloud dot config and I'm going to copy this here uh, here I'm gonna copy it and paste it here this is a file save it and you can in public link here the file press enter enable all the modules here one by one here here check this last one yeah this one there everything enabled everything is just but you have to make sure that everything is enabled here and Restart the Rebachi to apply all this and enable this module as well. SSL here. So after this one here, SSL and service Rebachi. Ah, sorry. Okay, sorry. Here, service of Apache restart. Change on here. Next cloud. Yes. Again. Service Apache reload. So you're going 
I'm going for the IV address from my machine here and we go to web browser slash next cloud here it's running so you don't have uh, it's here you don't have your uh, database or you don't have a user inside the database so it's uh, it's really simple to create it so I'm going also to show you how this how it will happen because if uh, you don't have already uh, you don't have here your database user you don't have a database password so here I'm going for my SQL here and minus user at root and minus p which is a password give it your password inside so here if I sh show databases here so we don't have the here the database next cloud so we are going to create it so create here the database next cloud so here oh sorry here oh sorry here it's here it's created and grant all here so I'm gonna give it you can give it whatever you want like admin or whatever you want so here as the password as well you can set it up whatever you want as well so press enter and slash privilege and exit so that's it now I'm going here so I'm gonna make it like admin give it give it whatever your password you want this is whatever you want here should be the database user which is admin which we created here the admin so here the database password which is the password is here so database password and what is the database name so it's next cloud so next cloud and finish it's gonna take some time because it will uh, create all the tables and everything in the database so it's gonna take time like in between two minutes three minutes so you can also you can check it's uh, it's working or not so you can my scale here go here and uh, show databases here oh sorry show the databases here and if you use next cloud here and show tables and you're gonna find that that it's, it's everything is here so uh, for example if I want to select everything from OC users here so you're going to find here the admin which we created already and the password here password hatch so it's gonna take time like between like three minutes until it it's uh, you can create it and that's it like and now it's done so if you have any questions just write a comment if you have anything else just tell me in the message me i hope this video going to help you more and thank you for watching